Patrick, for our kids out there that want to go after their dreams and goals and they're afraid to do it or somehow, tell me about why it's important to go for it and set goals and, and, and really, really uh, go after your passion in life. I mean, it's always important to do that. You always want to be doing something that you love, and that's what I did. I was a guy that never, you never thought I was going to be playing football, and I, that's where I am right now. And so, I mean, just always go after your dream, and no matter what anyone says, that's, I mean, that's all you have to do. How important is it to do the work, to be on time, and to be responsible? Oh, no doubt. You have to, you have to do the work first off. You have to outwork what they expect you to do. And then being on time, that's just the first thing. you got to be early. And then, uh, I mean, the, the best thing is just be responsible and take care of what you need to take care of. So that's why setting goals is so critical. It sets you up for confidence. It sets you up to understand yourself better. It sets you up to trust people. It sets you up to be accountable. It sets you up to be intentional. It sets you up to look at your progress. My biggest advice is to write down realistic dreams and goals for one year, five year, and ten years, and at the end of the year, reflect on them. Check them off. It feels so cool to check off a goal, whether that's about your health, about your career goals, about school. You can do it. Um, for me, goals are just my map that I follow for where I want to get to. So every time you get in the car, you have a plan on how you're going to get to where you're going. And uh, every time I set a goal, that's my plan on how I'm going to get to where I'm going. What would you tell kids today that uh, have dreams and goals about how to get there? Uh, it's worth a try. You know, uh, not doing it, not chasing it, you can have more regrets uh, than if you try and you, and you fail. So, um, I guess my advice is to go get it. You know, follow. How have you learned from failure in your career? Well, you learn a lot more from failure than you do from uh, from success. And uh, you know, I, I, for some reason, pick the sport that you fail the most at. You know, you, you win rarely out here, and you lose to. You lose a lot and uh, you know you can uh, learn from not making the same mistakes twice.